Let's learn the good living manners. Get up early in the morning. Early morning is the time when the air is fresh and unpolluted. Moreover, the mind being fresh in the morning, your brain also becomes more alert. If you learn something at the time, you can more easily grasp. Your capacity to learn increases. Brush your teeth well. Food particles get stuck between teeth. If left without cleaning, the teeth will rot. The bacteria in the rotten teeth will get into your stomach causing disease. Therefore, it is good if you brush your teeth in the morning, in the night before going to bed and after you eat your food. Take bath. Our body accumulates dust and dirt from the air around us. When you bath, the dirt is washed away, leaving your skin fresh and healthy. You will feel fresh after a bath. Pray to God and seek His guidance for the day. God for us is a source of love, happiness and hope. We get self-confidence with prayers. The whole family should pray at least once in a day for a few minutes. This will benefit all. Dress up neatly. Neatness does not mean one has to be rich or wear costly dresses. Even if you have two dresses only, you should wash them and wear them neatly. Neat dress will brighten up your mind, making you happy and cheerful. Do you know dirty clothes smell horribly? If you wear dirty clothes, no one will come near you. Comb your hair. Uncramped hair is a bad sight. Don't get trapped in uncombed hair. This leads to neat and dandruff. So wash and comb your hair and keep the comb also clean. Wash your hands and have your breakfast. Never keep your stomach empty, nor it should be stuffed. Eat healthy food. Say bye and off to school. A cheerful face is always a welcome sight. When you are ready with your uniform and school bag, show a smiling face to your mother. A bye then means you are happy to go to school and will be happy to come back at your home. Pay respect to your teacher. Good morning, ma'am. You learned to read and write from the teacher. What are you going to be as an adult starts with your teacher. You discipline from his or her. Showing respect to your teacher disciplines you. A good student always shows respect to all the teachers in the school. Be attentive in the class. Time is very precious and time wasted cannot be brought back. Therefore, when the teacher is taking lessons, listen to him, to her. Pay full attention to what he or she says. If you listen and understand in the class, you will not be confused when you study at home. After the school, come back home, change your clothes. As soon as you reach home, you should have a wash and wear fresh clothes. The dress you have been wearing the whole day will be full of sweat and dust. So remove the school dress and wear home dress. Wash your face and freshen up. Your body sweats and the sweat traps dust and dirt. So once you return from school, you should wash your face, hands and feet. Because these are the exposed parts. A good wash with soap will make you cheerful and happy. Complete your homework before you go to play. Sit down to do your homework. Never postpone homework for next day nor to be done at school next day. You can peacefully sleep if you have finished your homework.
play to relax your muscles and mind if the body is not properly toned up your mind will become dull an alert mind works wonder on the brain have you heard a sound mind in a sound body leads to healthy and wealthy life have some entertainment together with your family any entertainment shared with the family is more enjoyable than sitting alone it brings closeness and teaches you to share and care pray and thank god for all the nice things he has given you before you go to bed and sleep well during night prayer relaxes after a day's busy program work and study you go to bed in the night with the feeling of gratitude to god offer a prayer and thank god for all the help this will